It's beginning to look a lot like Christmas. Merry Christmas, everyone. Happy holidays. This is a very special Christmas episode of Yin Yang TK. I'm just sharing the Christmas joy, the Christmas spirit. And what better way than to sharing a Christmas story of the very first video game that I ever gotten during Christmas. So the year is 1999. I was nine years old. And the biggest thing that all 90s kids can agree, what was the biggest thing that was going on in 1999? It was Pokemon Mania. The phenomenon Pokemon was just exploding all over the world. First with the anime, then with the Pokemon cards, and then with the Game Boy games. We're talking about Pokemon Red, Blue, and then Yellow version as well. So everyone in my class, they had their Game Boys, they had their typical versions, either red, blue, and yellow. And we would see them playing each other uh, during recess or after school, training and battling. And that was the one thing that I really wanted. And I didn't have it uh, because growing up, you know, my family didn't have a lot of money, but I lived comfortably because my parents were hardworking and they were providing a roof over our heads and supporting myself and then also my older sister. So fast forward to December of 1999. I'm so ecstatic. I'm thinking like, this is the opportunity for me. I really, really want, you know, to get this Game Boy um, and then also, if possible, a Pokemon game. And if I had to choose between the three of them, it would be Pokemon Yellow because Pikachu is my favorite Pokemon of all time. So as the days are getting closer to Christmas. I remember on December 20th, around there, I went to the mall and I had a handwritten letter to Santa saying, please, Santa, I would really appreciate it if I could get, uh, you know, a Game Boy and then also uh, the Pokemon Yellow version. And if I can't have both one or the other would be just fine. And I would actually write it both in English and Spanish and I would give it to him in the mall right before I took you know, the, the Santa photo that everyone knows that goes around in the mall. So then on Christmas Eve, um, you know, for the typical Latino Christmas, uh, we would actually celebrate in my family a Christmas dinner on Christmas Eve. And then, you know, after it's done, uh, the adults will stay in the living room and then the children would go to the room and see any holiday specials, any Christmas movies that were going on and we would fall asleep at like around eight o'clock. And then around midnight, the adults, uh, my parents uh, would come up to my room and my sister's room and they would say, hey, Santa just arrived. He brought a lot of presents to both of you because you guys were so good kids. And he just wanted to say he loves you both. So we were excited and, uh, and, I, and I said to my mom and my dad, why didn't you wake me up? I wanted to see Santa, um, but at the end my excitement was just going to the tree so we go to the tree we see the presents um, and everyone get takes a turn to open the present so when my turn comes in i get a box and it says you know to dustin and it's from mom and dad then i start opening it and then i tear the you know the paper up and then i see the nintendo logo and it says game boy's pocket it was a blue Game Boy Pocket, the one that's right beside me that I still have up to this day. And I was so excited and it came with like these two games. It was like a Mario game and a soccer game. And I couldn't be much happier than that. And they can see the smile on my face. And I hugged them really both, kissed them on the cheek. And I said, thank you, mom and dad, uh, for you know giving me that present. And I'm kind of looking around to see like, well, where's Santa's present? I'm trying to figure that out. And the presents are being open left and right. My sister got whatever she wanted and she was happy. When it was basically no presents whatsoever, it looked like it, but at the very like top, there was like a little small box and it said to Dustin from Santa. And I'm thinking, huh, what could this be? It could be anything. So I go in, get the box. It's like around like really small and I start opening it up. And then when I tear it up, I see the iconic Pikachu image doing a thunderbolt and it says Pokemon yellow version special Pikachu edition and I was just so happy like you don't know how much ecstatic I was I was just screaming to the heavens thanking them and I was just running around and I was like oh my gosh I have Pokemon yellow 
And what's so funny is that my dad is not very good at giving presents. So he actually gave me like this hu huge box of batteries so I can have them with my Game Boy. And I was just playing Pokemon like nonstop. And I remember all the, you know, secrets that you had to go through the game. And oh man, it was just amazing. And it just reminds me of like all the, the, just the nostalgia and what it made me feel. And I even still have the Pokemon game right here. So I'm never going to, you know, trade it, never going to sell it because it just means that much to me. And, you know, it's always going to have a special place in my heart. So what about you guys? What was the very first um, video game that you ever got for Christmas and how did it make you feel? Write the comments below. And if you like the content of this video, please hit that like button, subscribe and make sure you hit that notification so you know when future videos are available. And again, I want to wish everyone a Merry Christmas, Feliz Navidad, Happy Holidays. I hope everyone enjoyed their Christmas with their family, their loved one, their friends, and whoever else. All right? So spread the love, the joy. Stay awesome.